It's exactly one year ago since my world turned back. I was loved and cared for by my uncle with whom I lived in faraway Ghana. I was full of hope of completing my secondary education and going to the university to train as a medical doctor until the world conspired against me to bury my joy, my hope and my future alive. There is nothing in this cruel world that makes meaning to me anymore. If only it is possible to unzip the mind and tell who is lying and who is telling the truth. If only it is possible for man to see beyond this ugly mask called face. Where do I really begin to tell my story? Follow me as I let you into the sad belly of this cruel world. Who am I seeing? Abus. Is everything all right? What of which am I saw? Abus. Mamuche, good afternoon. Where is Uche? Only one. I hope he's alive. Hey. It's all right, woman. Let me hear from them. They have not said anything. Nani. Nothing has happened to Uche. At least let us sit down. We've come to see you. What happened? Um, I am Nandi Okorongo, the chairman of the whole Igbo Union in Ghana. Ambrose is an executive member. We trust him so well. We rely on him. That is why we've accompanied him home. Um, go straight to the point. What happened? Ambrose lives happily with Uche. One day he sent him to go to a nearby shop mm -hmm. and buy things. Mm -hmm. You know children. Mm -hmm. On getting there, he got carried away and started playing football with his friends. Hey! No more! What is this? Let me hear something. They have not said anything. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Do you know, he stayed out late and refused to come into the house. Now, because of fear that he could be beaten. So, but whenever Abus goes to work, he go to where they keep the key, enter the house, then he will eat, bath, and change his clothes. This happened for about three or four days. I think also on the fourth day, Abus went to work. He now went in there. Picked his clothes mm. and mm. a large sum of money. Hey. And um, we presumed he has come back to the hey. 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 Um that's about hey. a week ago. Hey. One week ago. Hey. And you are just coming to tell me. Hey. Tonight, calm down. Take it easy. So calm down. Ghana is such a far place. Ah. Before the young girl will cross her, her flower mother, now get into this place, it will take him two to three days. You said he left before you people. Now, why did you arrive here before him? Tell me. We came by air. By air? Aeroplane. Aeroplane. Let's pray that he arrives here safely. Let's pray to God that Uche arrives here assembly. He will. He will. He will. Uche, my only son. Uche, my only son. He said, I'm Madam, calm down. Stop crying, Madam. Calm down. Stop crying. Madam, calm down. Madam, calm down. Madam, calm down. Nothing will happen to you. Nothing will happen to you, Madam. Wait. Calm down. Ubaka. 
Ubaka! Uh, 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 uh. Okay. You are welcome. How is my sister and her friend? Everybody is fine. What am I hearing? That Ambrose came all the way from Ghana to tell you stories about how Uchi, your son, disappeared from his house. Eh? Okay. I am confused myself. Confused? But they said he will soon be here. Since he traveled by road and Ghana is far away from here. Eh? And you believe him? You believe him? How can you be fooled by such a cock and bull story? Okay. Oh, what are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that you should use your tongue to cut your teeth. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Are you saying that Ambrose could know something about Uche's disappearance? Hey, Obaka. Listen to me. We are living in a strange world today. We don't know who to trust. I'm afraid about the kind of things our boys do to make money. Are you saying that? Uh, are you saying that? Uh, uh, I'm only thinking. Three months. Only three months after Ambrose took Uche to Ghana, he bought a car for him for his father. Yes. And today he's building a mighty house for himself. And you tell me you're confused. Now tell me. If it's that easy to make money, why haven't you become a millionaire? Hey! Hey, one! Oh, bro, stop falling on me. Hey, I'm Bruce, I'm born to me. My only seat. I'm going to see him. Hey! My only seat. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, dude. What do I do? What do I do? Tell me. First, we report this matter to the police. Let them know what is happening. So that if eventually she does not show up, they will know what to do. Osigo, my only seat. I know. What do you want to I know. What do you want to Osigo. Hey! Okay, what is it? Okay, what is it? The matter is between me and him. Everything is under control. Okay, hmm? okay, I'll see that. See, 
I want you to put everybody to shame. That is why I'm not sparing anything to make sure that you go to school. Hmm? The secondary school you are attending in Kumasi today is one of the best. It's only the very rich that can afford it. And that is the more reason why I want you to concentrate on your studies. So that by the time you get back to Nigeria, you would have qualified as a medical doctor. Yeah, huh? Thank you. I want you to promise me that. I promise you that. Huh? I promise you. <laughs> oh, I thank you. Thank you very much. Uncle, do you know what? What? By the time I qualify as a medical doctor, I promise you that you will be left out of my injections. <laughs> So, when we traveled to your village, your people did not believe our story. That was why I had to cook up that story to save the situation. I understand, Chairman. I understand. Um, what of that your police friend you reported the murder to? What is he doing? Well, he said uh, he would try his best. But that I shouldn't panic. That they've had uh, cases like this before. You know, that maybe Uche has, uh, you know, followed some bad friends out. That sometimes they might even leave town. But I shouldn't worry that he, he might still come back. But Chairman, I don't want to relax. I'm not, I'm not relaxing. Please, tell him to expect that action. We don't have time on our hands. Are you sure of what you're saying, Chief? I'm sure. Come on. Come on. One of my customers told me in confidence that the paramount ruler of uh, Angwa. You know Angwa now? I know Angwa. Fat man's wife. Uh -huh, that their king died. And they need seven heads to bury their king. Especially strangers. Is it me? Seven what? Seven human heads. Hey! Chu. Ambrose, nobody has said they have caught Uche. Anyway, that's a good piece of information. We have to concentrate our search around that area. Um, that reminds me, a friend told me in Takoradi that if we sent Uche's picture to any of these Pentecostal churches, if a pastor prays and anoints the picture, Uche will surely come back Uche. if he's still alive. Yeah, man, you don't understand. Eh? It's not as if I don't believe in all these churches, but there is no time. It is over one month now. And before the church will finish their fasting and praying, I, time will go, Chairman. Biko, I, I need help urgently. I need urgent help, Biko. Mm. Chairman, I think Ambrose should go to Nigeria and consult a native doctor. You see, I remember when my cousin got missing during this uh, June 12 crisis. We consulted one Babalao. This Babalao told us that he's still alive. You know what happened? After eight months, Chairman, Eight good months, he came back to the house. Uh, really? Chineke. Eight months, he came back to the house. What's your kind of boy? In that case, um, Ambrose, you have to go to Nigeria and check if, if Uche is still alive or not. I support Godi's suggestion. Oh, thank you. Chairman, the, the problem is that I'm very broke. If ever since Uche got missing, I've been spending money here and there, traveling from one place to another in search of him. Eh? I understand that, and we all know that too. Um, um, come to the shop this evening and pick some money to enable you to travel to Nigeria first thing tomorrow morning. <gasps> Chineke Daru, Chairman, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Who is it? I'm coming. No, again. Hey, do I'm in trouble? Trouble? What is it? Do you know that up till now I still haven't found Uche? Uche? Up till now? Up till now. 
It hey. worked till now. Hey. I've tried everything people prescribed and yet no result. Nah, I'm oh man. What is your next line of action now? Yeah. I, I'm on my way to the village. At least let me let my people know that I still haven't found him. Village? Yes, now. Going home to the village to tell them what? Nana, what for you? Give it your camera. What else do you want me to do now? You want them to do you wrong? What are you going to tell them that will make them believe your story? Listen, they are already speculating that you used Uche to do money rituals. Eh? Yes. And how, how, what story are you going to tell them? No. That will make them believe you. How can anybody say anything like that now? John Omni. John Omni. See, I know what to do. There is this uh, particular Babalawo at Ije Bode. At least um, he's reputed for investigating spiritual matters with him 100% success. Yes, he will tell us if Uche is still alive, where he is and how to find him. Yeah. Yes. It's true. You know, a member of our Ibu Union yeah. in Ghana yeah. said a similar thing. Yeah. But in my place, do you know where it is? Do you know? The... Yeah, nah, I told you now, I know the place. 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 Okay? Have you eaten? I'll get you food. Nah, I'm not, I'm not hungry. I don't have the appetite. <laughs> See how lean you are. Eh? Why you? Why? See, by tomorrow you won't be like this. I am telling you. Uh -huh. I'll get... See, just in the golden way. I'll get you food, man. See, by tomorrow you won't be like this. Yes. When a mighty tree falls, the little birds will scatter in the forest. Tell me and I will tell them. Then you. I hear you. <laughs> Sit down, my son. Sinedu, Baba. You have come with your cousin Ambrose. To look for who say, who is the cousin to both of you? <laughs> yes, Baba. Yes. I know <laughs> that he told does not run in the daytime for nothing. Benny, did you come with the photograph? Photograph. Benny. No, we did not bring it. In that case, to enable me to carry out my investigation proper, you are going to provide a human skull and a bone of a human leg. But, Baba? Only it, my son. This skull will enable me to ascertain whether he's dead or alive. Why the leg bone? We enable me to find wherever he is, if he's still alive. Baba, uh, can't we offer you money to buy this item? <laughs> yes. <laughs> My son. Baba. Such case don't come often. So we don't keep such items here. Yeah, yeah. Baba. Where can we find such items to buy? You know, they are not very common items. <laughs> My son, the world is so deep. If you don't dig hard, you won't find much. It is in everywhere. Everywhere in the market. Go and search for it. You will find it. My spirit assures you. You can go, my son. Thank you, Baba. Thank you, Baba. Mm. We'll be back. It's all right, my son. <laughs> Baba. Yes, my son. What, what if we don't get the items today? Will tomorrow be too late? 
Hmm. Oh, God, my boy. Oh, God, so yeah. <laughs> tell me, tell me. And I will tell them. Benny, Benny. <laughs> my son. My oracle gives you three days. Three days. To look for the right items. Benny. Three days, new. Oh, my lady. Thank you, Baba. Thank you. You Thank can you very go. Much. You can go, my son. Oh, God, my bell. Go to Soya. Yes. I am here to serve you, okay? Benny. No, boy, come down. There's no problem. There is nothing you're looking for on the surface of this head that you can see. You know the Baba ba assured us, so let's go. Chino, do, 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 do you even know what you're talking about? What are you saying? Human parts, human parts. Who do I need to ask where I will get human bones to buy from? Look, I, I, I'd rather go back to Ghana and get Uche's picture. It's better. Ghana? Yes, sir. And come back in three days. Uh -huh. Unless you still have a, a, a flight money or ticket so that you can buy your ticket, then you go. Now, I'm not coming here and go. It's true. Mm -hmm. but, but, but the problem is, can we get these items to buy? Definitely. Mm -hmm. I'm assuring you, listen, you go to Hunter. Mm -hmm. There is a place I know, in Ose Main Market, where I'm sure you will buy those items. Mm -hmm. Yes, now. You're sure we can get them there? Yes. So why are we wasting time? Let's start going there immediately now. Um, I, I won't be able to go with you right now. It's just that uh, when we get to the house, I'll write out the address for you so that you can be able to go. Yep. Then let's sign up. And let's go. So Come on now, let's go. I'm telling you. Okay, let's go. This is the best thing we have done so far in this case. Yeah? Now that we have elected the place, we are on the safe side. If eventually he finds your son, fair enough. yourself that you have lost your only son and take action against the man who is responsible for his disappearance be better for you and for all of us okay who could have believed that Ambrose could harm Uche as close as they were who? it means you don't understand the young men of nowadays and their love for quick money So far, we have done all we are supposed to do. Ambrose cannot remain in Ghana forever. Whenever he steps here in the village, the police will arrest him. They're all my friends. Okay, sir. We don't fight now. As soon as he comes into town, let us know. We will come and love him. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. Bye, sir. Lagos, 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 Lagos,
Please, I, I don't. I, I, Keep quiet, my friend. Thank you. You said your name is Ambrose Ujoko Ujuku. Yes, officer. And that you live in Ghana? Yes. We are you not the one that uh, came the other day, uh, about a week ago, to report to your people here that uh, you are looking for your brother? Yes, exactly, officer. That is what I've been trying to explain. Hey! hey. Oh. This is the man that uh, two men came here the other day to report to us that he used, he killed his brother that was living with him in Ghana. Finished. The one that was alleged to have used his younger brother for money rituals. That's the one. It's a lie. Also, that is what I didn't do it. Shut up. I didn't do it like that. Hey. Uh, shut up. Is the kind of thing you do. I have been doing it. This is the man. I, I thought finished. we have had the end of Otokoto. Uh, so we are the part two. Officer, me. Yes. Keep yes. Shut, yes. shut up your mouth. Shut up. Yes. Thank you very much, officer. Uh, we shall handle the case from this point. So, since we had already declared him uh, wanted, eh? thank you very much. Oh, that's all right. Thank you. Well, thank you. Uh, thank you very much. Eh? Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, I'm ready to be a hand. So that is the kind of business. Hey, come on. Deal with him. My friends, I did not do it. I did not do it. I did not do it. Officer, I did not do it. I did not do it. I did not do it. He's a suspected ritual killer. God forbid. Ambrose. Papa. Is it true? He was what? caught in possession of human skulls and bones. It's a lie. Ambrose, is it true? Papa, they won't even let me explain, eh? I only want to say a native doctor in connection with two channels disappearing. Shut up! I want him to talk. Hey, Mr. Man. We have a warrant to search this house, if this is your house. In fact, you are going to get out with him. Now move! Move! Papa Bruce! Move. Papa Bruce! What happened? Eh? Go and call your mother! Since you were born, I have never had any report that you stole anybody's yam or cocoyam. That type of behavior is not in our family plan. The offspring of a lion does not eat grass. I have never killed anybody before. My father never told me that he killed anybody, nor did his father or grandfather. So you cannot be different. You are the son of Edward Njoko Utuku. Me. Young man. Oyinine. Tell me the truth. Have you any hand in the disappearance of Utuku Utuku? And how did you come about the human bones in your possession? Papa. Papa, you... You doubting me, Papa. I've told you, Papa, I don't know anything about Uchela's disappearance. I came back from the shop one evening, Papa. And I sent Uchela to go and get my goods from where I, I, I left them. That was the last I saw of Uche, Papa. That was the last. Magachuku God in heaven is my witness, Papa. I don't know anything about it. And concerning the bones, ever since Uche got missing, Papa, I've been looking for him all over the place. He got to a point, a friend advised me that I should go and see a native doctor. That he knows a native doctor that will help us trace wherever Uche is if he's still alive, Papa. He was even Piccolo who took me to the native doctor and he requested that you can get human parts, human bones. That the human bones will enable him to find out wherever Uche is. Papa, honestly, Papa, I don't know what else is. Thank you, Mr. Man. Thank you. 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 Thank you
you say you do not know anything about it. I believe you. I have always believed you. But why did you not report to the police in Ghana? Papa. Listen, Papa, this whole thing is like a dream, Papa. <laughs> Papa, I told my friend, though. Eh? I told my police friend in Ghana. And he told me not to worry, Papa. He said I should not worry, that he will handle the case. I can't explain why. I don't know why. I don't know. I, I never knew he did not even make any official report at the station, Papa. I don't know why, Papa. Sorry. I have only asked you a question like a father. We have a saying that the mouth takes the blame for not asking. If you say you do not do anything about it, I believe you. <laughs> don't worry. If you are innocent, my ancestors will see you through. I'm making arrangements. We'll see you later. <laughs> Let me tell you, if you like, cry from now till God comes down from heaven. You can never marry a man who uses his relations for blood money. Mama, it's a lie. He's innocent. He cannot do a thing like that. I know him very well. I know him very well. He's innocent. He's innocent. That night snake can never be innocent. A man who had the mind to impregnate another woman's daughter without paying her dairy, can never be innocent. He can do and undo. Now listen to me. Tomorrow, you must go to Dr. Michael and remove this pregnancy. Mama, it's a lie. I cannot remove this pregnancy. I love Ambrose very much. I love him. I know he's innocent and I must marry him. <laughs> hey. The death that will kill a dog does not allow it to hear the master's whistle. Don't remove this pregnancy tomorrow, and you will cease to be called Chinere's daughter. Rubbish. <laughs> Did I not tell you? Did I not tell you? Is everything not happening now to reveal itself? When I told you that our young men of nowadays can do anything for money, did you believe me? Okay. Who would have believed that as gentle as Ambrose is, he's into ritual killings and all that? Who? Appearance can be deceptive. Appearance can be deceptive. Someone told me that he was bringing those human parts, the bones and the skulls into this village to bury. And if he has succeeded, nothing more will have been heard about Richard's disappearance. Okay. My problem now is that they say even if police decide to take this case to court, uh -huh. that the court will not entertain it because the matter did not happen here in Nigeria. That is rubbish. Absolute rubbish. They cannot use any stupid, any stupid logic to deny us of justice in this case. They cannot. The important thing is that Ambrose killed Uche, his little cousin, who was handed over to him to cater for. Everything possible shall be done to make sure that the court hears this case. The evidence is there all over the place. What are you afraid of? Please, any way you can go to help me to make sure that those who plucked my only eye do not go free shall be appreciated. My in-law, I have told you not to worry. I cannot sit by and watch evildoers go free in this case. Don't worry. They cannot use legal jargons to set Ambrose free. I assure you.
Roman Bruce. Eat something. You cannot continue like this. Please. What more is there to live for? What am I living for? Does it matter if I live or die? Ambrose has clapped shame across my face. Let this come and take me. Look, if you believe that Ambrose did it, then you don't know your son. If he's truly innocent, what was he doing with human skulls and human parts found on him? He told me how he came about them, and I believe him. Look, Mama Ambrose, the enemy is at work. Ambrose needs our support so that he can shame his enemies. Uh, remember your dream that night? Something tells me that it was to warn us about what our enemies are planning against us. But we never took that dream seriously. You can't convince me. Are you telling me that it's our enemies that asked him to go and collect human skulls and human parts? Alright. Have you asked yourself what Mokedi, my sister's husband's interest is in this whole matter? Have you? If he hadn't led into his trap, Mokedi wouldn't have had anything to do with us. It's okay. It's okay. By the grace of God, nothing will happen to him. They will not kill him because my ancestors know that he's innocent. You claimed you reported the matter to the police in Ghana, right? Yes, officer, I did. There you lie again. I said there you lie again. Because we have radioed Lagos. And Lagos has also radioed Ghana. And the police in Ghana said they don't have any such report in their record. Uh, and you are here lying. Officer, I I'm said you lying. are here lying. Officer, I'm not lying. Then I'm not lying. I, I, I told my police friend in Ghana. And he said he will handle the matter. But did he? Did he? Answer it. Better say the truth now. Answer you lose one of your eyes. Did he? Officer, I'm not lying. Now say the truth. Believe me, I'm say not lying, truth. officer. Say the truth. The last time I, I saw him, he, he told me not to worry that they've had cases like this before. That one day Uche will still come back to the house. That maybe he has gone with some of his bad friends. Oh, 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 oh. You so you did not even make it official. Gambler. You were gambling with somebody's life. Imagine, look at that. In fact, you are a chronic liar. Eh? You are a chronic liar. You are lying, my friend. You are finished. You are finished. Take him off. Come on, come on, stand up. Move, sir. move, move, sir. move. Come on, move. Yeah. My people, you all know what happened between Ambrose, Joko's son, and the junior brother whom he took to Ghana. It's very strange. I have decided that nobody will have any dealings with that family anymore. Yes. Yes. Exactly. Yes. Yes. If we I don't think any one of us here has anything against that decision. At all. Not at all. At all. Because it is strange in this community for a man to use his brother or any human being. To make up we go. Thank you, my people. I know that the matter is still in court. But we will take our own decisions here. Because that boy has brought shame and disgrace to this our community. Ezakaja, what is it? I was coming to see Ezakaja. I what? need your help. I what is your problem? The case against Ambrose, my son, comes up next tomorrow. The lawyer insists that his fees must be paid in full before he can appear to defend him. I am just I... coming from an emergency meeting of Council of Elders and Chiefs. Yes. To be sincere, this is what we want to use as a test case for those who might be wanting to have a hand in blood money. Uh, but there is a Kajako, my son Ambrose is innocent. He did not... What about the human skull and bone found on him? He is not innocent at all. He is guilty. Yes, Kajako, but please... I am telling you, 
even the Igwe and everybody, they've said we shouldn't have any dealings with you. Go away from my house. Ndaku, go away. Go away from my house. Go. Please. Please. Please, Please. What am I going to do now? What am I going to do for my brother? Listen, mister. This is not a charity organization. If you need my services, you have to pay for it. I know. I don't have the money now. But when you bail him, then he can pay you. He's in business. Then you go and borrow. I have tried. But no one is willing to lend me money. Why? Well, the community warned everyone to steer clear of the matter. Everyone seemed to believe that uh, he did it. Well, I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do to help you. I am in business to make money. I know, I know, please, but I need your help. Good day, sir. Please. Hey, I need your help, please. Now. I have other things to attend to. Please, but you... Good day, sir. I have other things to attend to. Please, please. Am I going to compile pleases to pay my staff? Just imagine. Mama! Mama! Hey. Mama, is it? Okay, I'm going to go. Ambrose has killed me! Hey! Ambrose has killed me! Oh. Mama! I know he cannot. <laughs> Mama, I know Ambrose cannot do a thing like that. I know, I know it. I know him very well, Ambrose can Mama Ambrose, Mama Ambrose, like you are still crying, eh? You are still crying. <laughs> I've won you. Papa, how are you? Papa, I know very well that Ambrose did not do it. I know he cannot do a thing like that. He's innocent. Yes, my daughter. I know Ambrose is innocent. No son of mine would do a thing like that. I am convinced. My enemies are only trying to discredit Ambrose. Oh, Ambrose. How did you go? Any success? The lawyer insists on getting his fee in full. I have tried all my friends and none of them can help. Hey, God, oh, 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 God, why? Papa, I will try and talk to my father. I know he can help. I know. But I know Ambrose is innocent. Mm. I know he did not do it. Mm. I know. Yes. I want to buy sugar. Sugar? Yes. How many packets? Uh, one packet. One? Yes. And for them, are you? No, I know they sell again. Please, I know they sell. Is this not sugar? Not sugar, I know. But for you, no, go sell you won't go carry your old way go picking money. Come buy me a market. Madam, no be here. Come out here, madam. It's go. Please go. Go leave my stuff. Go fear what? She don't care about her job. Hey. Kamaka, to fight for your Ogwego son. Do you understand me? Because if anything happens to her, if anything happens to her, my sister is not I like that. Not it's not like that. I want you. Hey. Hey,
have you heard what? The man that wants to marry her, who lives in Ghana, uses his own blood brother to make money. Hey, is your man? That's a lie. When did you hear that one? So you've not heard. After he came to report that Uche was missing, the police even arrested him with human head, breast, even bones. That's how they make money. True word. True word. Though. They will come every festive period with expensive cars, distributing items, gifts to people, even building fine fine houses. God will punish all of them. Hey, this year, come and save your daughter. So. Please, I want you to help him out. Please. Ataku, I can see that something is wrong with your head. Something is definitely wrong with your head. A murderer, and you still want to marry him? Eh? Now you are even standing here asking me for money to pay the lawyer. Eh? Go and thank your God that you've not been used for ritual making. Papa, believe me, he's innocent. He did not do it. Shut up! Shut that your dirty mouth off and I'll get out of my face. Get out! Papa. Get out of this place. Come on. Idiot. This is not my daughter. Nonsense! You want to marry a murderer? But I won't see in this house. Let me hear that one. Let me hear it again from your mouth. Yeah. You are my sister in law. Mm. I'm sure Andrew's my son. Is your son too? He said he did not do it. Please intervene in this matter. Talk to your husband. Because he's the one that is carrying this rumor, carrying this matter all over the place. Agnes, my Ambrose father is my senior brother. Uche's father is my younger brother. I am the only woman, in between two of them. I cannot sit down and see any of them cheating each other and keep quiet. What Ambrose did to Uche is wrong. I cannot support him. What I'm saying is that Ambrose did not do it. Then where is Uche whom he took to Ghana? Oh, he has to be given some bodies to look for him. Now, for four months. For four months, you want to give him time again? <laughs> Markego, please, Markego, please. I still maintain that Ambrose did not do it. <laughs> but everybody believes he killed him to make money. Oh, oh my God, does that? Ambrose did not kill him. <laughs> I did not suckle the murderer. But I know that with time, God will put my enemies to shame. But please, please. Talk to your husband. Let him take it easy. Let him take it easy. He's the one that is carrying this matter all over the place. <laughs> you're supposed to do in life to become somebody only to start running around for a murderer. Papa, Ambrose, Ambrose is not a murderer. I've told you. He's my fiancé. He's not a murderer. Ah, ah. Ambrose is not a murderer, but you are fiancé. Now, you must explain to me now what a man who butchers his relation is called. Tell me. Yeah? Papa. What is he? He brought the motor. Papa, 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 Is it not you that is following you? Huh? Is it not you? No, I will. I must make sure I kill that bitch. He's going to stop that damn inside. Abruz is not a murderer. It is true that they say sentiment has no place in love. But I actually think it does. I am aware that the whole community has decreed that no native of Isiago should have anything to do with the case. But I will take the risk and defend your husband for two sentimental reasons. 
One, you're a young woman like myself. And secondly, I've known your proposed husband, Ambrose, for quite a long time now. We attended the same primary school. He's such a cool-headed person and quite harmless. So I wonder who is plotting this against him. Thank you very much. Don't worry. I'll see your husband, Ambrose, in police custody, and I'll prepare my defense. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm grateful. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Ambrose, one last question. I need the truth from you. Because for me to prepare my defense well, I need the truth. Now, those human bones that were found with you, how did you come about them? Thank you very much. That is what I've been trying to explain to them, but they won't even let me talk. Ever since my brother got missing, I'm really... Hey, 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 There are six. See, make this thing seven. See, my father was a titled man and the custom demand that he should be buried with at least seven heads. You don't have to worry about that. Tomorrow we will make them seven minutes. But I mean, why is the ceremony taking so long? Four months. Oh, it's our custom, it's our custom. So you don't you don't need to worry about that. Hmm? Make sure our cash is intact. I mean full cash. By the end of tomorrow, I have to come and pay you cash as soon as they're completed. You know it's not easy to catch all these people. Consider the job done. Okay. Consider the job done. Okay. So guys, guys, come, come. Um, tomorrow, we will try that other village. Okay. Yes, uh, where we captured two animals. Yeah. Okay. 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 I said shut up and listen to me. The whole community cannot be wrong. And you alone will be right. But Papa, I... Listen, I cannot risk being on your side because you are trying to be what I don't know. Lawyer. Lawyer and scenario. And let me tell you, if you insist of representing that on your way go Ambrose, count yourselves as no more. Doing my, job, doing my profession. Count yourself as no more. 
a daughter of Elder Moe Moe Ogun. I'm trying to do my Should you make you sleep? Sleep, 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 sleep. If I see you swear again.
Let's find our way out of this forest. They must be searching for us. Come, uh, I'm sorry, uh, come, let's find our way. Hey, hey, hide, hide. How these guys manage to escape? I, I, I don't look at them. Look at them. Huh? Oh, 
Hello. Come and join us. Where are you going? Village in a flower town. Yes, yes, yes. What brought you here? Oh, we missed our way. They caught us in a Kai village where their king died. They locked us there for four months. They wanted to kill us to bury their dead king, but we escaped. These people, when will they stop this? Their usual caution. Where are you going? We're looking for a way to get out from here and go back to Bompe village. Please help us. Come, follow me. I'll show you a way out. Huh? Let's go. We sucked the same breast. We grew up in our parents' house as, as if we were twins. And that was because we loved each other. Ubaka, when my son Ambrose became successful in business, I encouraged him to take your son Uche along with him to Ghana. So that Uche can continue his education there because he showed signs that, uh, of intelligence in his studies. Ubaka, why have you forgotten all that so easily? Why do you think that Moked, our son-in-law, will love your son more than I, your own brother? Have you finished? Njob, give me just one reason why you believe that Ambrose is innocent of the allegation leveled against him. And I also want you to convince me that Uche, my son, disappeared into thin air. I don't know, but Ambrose told me that he did not do it and I believe him. Your son Uche simply disappeared. No, no, look, Ambrose is my son. He has never lied to me before. Job. Leave my house. I said, leave my house! Obaka. Njoko, you cannot because you are my brother. And you, you put... 
butter into my eyes and you expect me to keep quiet. Now get out! Get out of this place before my wife meets you or she will eat you raw! Out! And get out! Where is my brother? He, he traveled to the village three weeks ago. He, and he's not here back. But he left his keys with us. Okay, let me have the key. Ah, it's Uche. Uche. Yes, sir. My God, Uche. I'm coming down. Uche. Uche, my son. Welcome. Oh, you cause all of us a lot of trouble. Your brother traveled home to tell home people what has happened to you. Oh, you must be very tired and hungry. We better find something for you to eat first, and then you rest and tell us what happened to you. Let them get, get food for him. We can give you food to eat first before you tell us what all happened. Come, 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 And we thank you immensely, sir, for taking care of him. Um, I think the best thing for us to do is to send him back to Nigeria. I agree with you, and I think one of you should accompany him. That would have been the best thing for us to do. But you see, since this matter started, our businesses have been suffering. Um, which is no longer a baby. He can find his way when he gets to Nigeria. Yes. Or oh, Uche. Can't you? I can't, sir. Once I get to Lagos, I can locate my brother's house in Ajego. Are you sure? Yes, sir. But okay. once I locate my brother Chinedu's house, he can take me to the village. In that case, we have to arrange for some money and put him in a Lagos bound plane tomorrow. Once again, we thank you very much, sir, for your concern and cooperation since this matter started. Thank you very much, sir. What are you doing here? I, I just came down from Lagos this morning. Yes? Yes, and I, I heard about uh, the case against uh, Ambrose. What's your business with the case against Ambrose? I personally took him to the native doctor. What? Yes, that's what I did. And then... I, uh, I took him by the Babala. Are you going mad? Father, I personally wrote the Shedu. Shh! I said, shut up! If you know that I'm your father, I don't want to hear this from you again. If you know that I'm your father, don't repeat what you just said. How long have you been in Lagos? Why haven't you made all the millions? Children, I said, shut up your mouth and go back to Lagos. Can you please tell this honorable cause your name, where you live, and what you do for a living? My name is Okechuku Moke. I live at number 24 Adoye Street, Ajebule. I'm a trader. I trade in second-hand clothing, popularly known as Okrika. Do you know the accused? 
Very well, it's my village man. You should reclaim it. Can you please tell this honorable court what transpired between you and the accused on February 13th, 1994? Objection, my lord. Objection overruled. The witness should please answer the question. As your lordship pleases. As your lordship pleases. You may continue. Thank you, my lord. On the 13th of February, 1994, at exactly 6.30 p.m., I was coming back from Utonu, where I had gone to buy Okrika. The vehicle in which we were traveling with spoiled along the road at Ilogu, somewhere very close to Badagri. I came down and went into the bush to ease myself. Lo and behold, I, I, I saw Ambus holding his little cousin by the hand. They were heading into the bush. Okay, to me? My lord is lying. Oh, Did you ask him? Papa is lying. What was that? I'm not in court. When the accused behave himself, you are in court. Please, you may continue. Thank you, my lord. My lord, with the other hand, he, he was having a machete and some juju. And then they were heading into the bush. I called him. They turned, saw me, and ignored me. I called him again, he, he never turned back. He went into the forest. When you saw the accused person and recognized him, did you make any effort stopping him, knowing that he might be going to harm his little cousin? I was afraid. Besides, he was having a machete and some juju. Even when I summoned up courage to go after him, the driver was already calling. So I had to go and join you. That will be all for this witness, my lord. My judgment. Having considered all the evidences and exhibits presented by the prosecution and the defense, I am totally convinced that the case of murder of one Uche Ujuku brought against Ambrose Ujuku has been proved beyond all reasonable doubt. I have, however, noted the plea for clemency by the defense counsel. But it is pertinent to point out that the case before us involves loss of human life, which the state regards as sacrosanct. I, therefore, sentence the accused person to death by hanging. He is, however, free to make an appeal against his ruling within 21 days. I see a lot she played. My Lord, I did not do it. I did not kill my brother, my lord. They are lying, my lord. What is my witness? I didn't do it. Papa, I did not do it. Papa, I did not do it. Even if they have me, don't know I do not do it. Papa, Papa, I said, Uncle, move. Uncle, I didn't do it. Papa. My lord, I didn't do it. How do I get to Ajegule? Ajegule? Yes. Where are you coming from? I'm coming from Ghana. My brother lives in Ajegule, so I want to go and see him. Ajegule? Yes. I'm coming from Ghana? Yes. You want to get to Ajegule? Yes. Okay, follow me. Come. Okay, thank you. Sorry, sorry. 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 Sorry, sorry.
I'm finishing out the Please, I'm going down to the east. But I don't have any money on me. I was, I was coming from Ghana before I was here. Go punish you there. I said, go punish you. Now, some of the work around the typical property, you come from Ghana. Why not come from London or Jamaica? Okay, huh? Okay, don't go away Okay, please. Okay. You see that? Don't go away. You eat your ass. So what is the problem? We're gonna transport. I have only 300 naira. I will And you cannot lead me to Enugu. Transport to go where? To Enugu. Enugu. Yes. Transport. You are sure you know that I got those boys. Where you go? They tip people money up and down. I got it. I know they like that. Okay. Okay. If I give you money. So go home, and I catch you here tomorrow. Huh? You don't finish. Okay. If you see me here tomorrow, we could huh? my leg. How much you say you get there? 300. 300? Yes. Okay. Yes. Take yes. this one, 500 naira. This night, enter Agoroka. Go back to where you come from. Okay. I'm going to go to huh? I'm If I catch you here tomorrow. Thank you. Okay. Uh, hey, hey. I will go. Okay. Okay, thank you. <laughs> serve as a deterrent to other sons and daughters of this land who want to involve in such act. Yes. 
They said he left Ghana since that he came to the village and he's not yet back. They're looking for him in Ghana. See your last wish to the world. I am dying for a crime I never committed. I am not a ritualist. I did not kill my brother. But I have one last thing to say. One day, one day the truth shall be uncovered and the whole world shall see it. God in heaven is my witness. Uche, wherever you are, I want you to know that I do not have a hand in your disappearance. And if I do, let my hanging today be justified. And let my whole family be exterminated from the surface of this earth. And if I do not, Mr. Ambrose, the Bible says that with mouth confession is made unto salvation, while with heart man be fed unto righteousness. Do you wish to confess your sins and be saved? Once more I ask again, do you wish to confess your sins and be saved? In the name of the Father and of the 
Son, the Holy Spirit. Father God Almighty, King of Glory, I thank you this day for the life you've given us. And I thank you for the life of this young man. And I commit his soul into your able hands. That whatever sins he has committed, may him grant him pardon in Jesus' name. Even as he comes back to you, I ask that you grant pardon unto his soul. And all this I ask through the name of Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Hey, Ambrose, you are there. 
inside. Yes. But you are living inside me. Because I'm carrying your baby. And when I give back to him, I shall tell him that the father was a hero. Isiago, thank you. Thank you all for making my baby fatherless. Thank you. <laughs> Ambrose, I trusted you. I believed you. I tried my best. But nobody listened to me. Hey! Ambrose! Ambrose! <laughs> Tibo, 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 Tibo,